Hi guys, it's us, Alan, and my nephew Christopher. We're doing another video for you. Again, we had marvelous, uh, great reviews on the first one, and we're doing a second one. And Christopher, since you know this, take it away. Okay, very cool. Uh, first thing we got in our thing here, our throw up bucket, is a heater bag. So that's what's going to help warm the food today. We've got our usual oversized knife because that's how we roll. A pair of scissors just in case we need to cut something. Uh, we will do plates because we're only doing one package of food today. Marvelous. And uh, we want to be able to split it up. We've got our drinking apparatus. Bottle of water for him, bottle of water for me. And empty bucket. And we've got our leftover things from last video. So 10 year old peanut butter and 10 year old ketchup. If we need them. We got this food. It was at a place down uh, Mississauga. It was the at the Army Issue. And you can go to the website armyissue.com and ask for Jeroen. He's a very nice person. He'll take care of you with all the Army goodies that you want to get. This is what we uh, bought. And it was, was it chili? It's chili menu. What is it? Lot 19, menu number 13. Wow. Military ration. Alrighty. Wanna slice it open? Make quick work of it? Yeah, okay. It's the messing around with it. Alright, hold on. There we go. You want to have the honors to unload all this? Yeah, let's do it. Let's Since do it. Uh, you're the uh, army guy. I'm the resident army guy in the house here. So first thing I noticed right off the bat is a little napkin. It's compressed into a pill-sized uh, little pod, what which is pretty pod? cool. I've never seen it like that. This has certainly changed since the time that I was in there. We have our entree, which is chili. Okay. So let's open that up in a moment. We have sweet and creamy Nescafe. All right, that's pretty cool. Full size chocolate bar. Wow. The usual book of matches. Is it from the same company? Yeah, any match company for sure. Oh, peanut butter's changed. Wow. <laughs> peanut butter has changed. So that's the old one. This is the new one. Let's keep the old one separate just to make sure. The drink bag has changed a little bit, not too much. Ah, this is the cool part. We have two sport drinks. One for you, one for me. Guess who makes them? Who? Dr. Utger. Wow. The pizza guy. The pizza guy. Oh, interesting. What's this? Teriyaki beef jerky. <whistles> oh, that's pretty cool. Mother. Solid beef jerky. It's a hamburger bun. <gasps> Outstanding. Tic Tacs. Not like the gum we had last time. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, indeed. Oh, this is cool, too. Check that out. It's a little Tabasco packet. Wow. Yeah. There is a paper towel. Ah. And it's like a spork. So it's a spoon and a fork. Cool. Paper towel. Nothing special about that. Alrighty, we'll leave that here. And we will take the empty package and put it off to the side. But this is dessert. Let's start with, oh, sliced apples. There it is. So first thing we have to do is we actually have to open up the main course or the entree. And we have to put it in this baggie here. So when I was in, they always told us never fill this up with water and operate it indoors. Oh. So you think we should go at night? No, not today, no. Garbage weather out there today. No uh, chance. So we will chance it inside. Sounds good? Oh, yeah. Okay. So we tear off the top here. Or not. There we go. Open it up. It's kind of like those, uh, remember those heater packs that you put in your gloves? Oh, yeah. Those are okay, yeah. So it's kind of like that. So you take some water. Well, you don't put water in your gloves, but it works on the same premise. So we're going to fill it up to that line right there. Okay. And then we're going to toss that little pack in there. So I'm going to ask you to open up that uh, the main course there. Already. ready. 
Hello. Look at this. Oh, you can hear it. Yeah, you can. Oh, it's smoking oh. too. Wow. You see that? Yeah, that's why you don't. Oh, yeah. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this guy. I'm gonna hold it. Oh, pop uh, it in. I'm gonna ask you to open up that. Wow, that's hot. This. This. Okay. Wow. All right. So we'll fold this up like that, and I'm gonna ask you to pass me that box. Put it. Can you hold that corner there? Just careful. It's good. Mm -hmm. Careful. Yeah. All right. And that bad boy's gonna go right here, and he's gonna cook for a little bit. So, I think the next best thing is to get some juice happening. All so right. We have two different juices. So, what flavor did you get for uh, fruit drink? I got. Uh, what is it? Oh, fruit punch, top three. Yeah, fruit punch. Oh, perfect. All right, so we got two choices. We can toss it in the jars, or we can toss it in here and then split it afterwards. Toss it in the in the bag, and we'll split it. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. Marvelous. It smells pretty good. Wow. So that's the inside of it. It's having a tough time zooming for some reason. There we go. So that's the inside of it. Not too bad. Not too bad. Come on. There you go. Marvelous. Got it. I don't know what you do. I see you open that guy up. Okay. I'll leave this one here. Take a picture. That's pretty cool. It's got a little maple leaf on there, too. Oh, yeah. There you go. Um, I took a video of the app. Uh, yeah, I took a video of that one too. There's some there. Got it. There you go. Very cool. You want to get that uh, all expanded or? Oh, this? Yeah, I think you pour water on it or? I, um, I don't know. You know what? It's exactly like a capsule. I don't know. I haven't done this before. Let's see. Do not eat. <laughs> no. <laughs> just add water. Okay. Yeah, so I guess just... Uh, we can always throw it in the bucket here. Add a little water to it and see what happens. Yeah? But, uh, yeah. yeah, go for it. Okay. So I'm going to give you this first juice. And then I'll make the other one and I'll put that in my jar. Okay. Look at this. I'm gonna... Oh, that's so cool. It expanded. Wow. Okay. Yeah, pull it out and see if it separates now. Okay, hold on. Oh, yes. Yeah. Look, Look at, at that. that. That's pretty awesome. Tricky to separate, but it is. Outstanding. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's pretty cool. Wow. That's pretty cool. Let's put that over here. In case anybody throws up, they can wipe themselves. Yes. I'm going to ask you for your fruit drink so I can mix it up here. And then okay, here you go. It appears that we have a small visitor over there. Hello. It's the, our cat. full bottle of water. It certainly looks like Kool-Aid, eh? Oh, yeah. I know the first one wasn't too bad. No, no, no I was surprised with that. I was shocked. Oh, 
All right. So we will leave these guys over here. Okay. Now, this main entree, this main course, has been cooking for a little bit. Yes. So we got a couple options. We can work backwards by eating dessert first, or we can actually do what's supposed to be done properly by eating this first. Do that first. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's still cooking. Wow. Okay. All right. Yeah, it's nice and uh, hot now. All right. So this is our package of chili here. Okay. So good? It should be done. Yeah. All I right. think so. It feels like a giant bag of cat food, eh? <laughs> Oh yeah. All right. So here we go. I think it feels pretty full, so I'm gonna open it up at the top notches here. Make sure we get it already. Food down. Ooh! Kind of wow. shot all over me there. Let's move this for a second. There go. All right. So. It just looks like regular chili, eh? Yeah, it does. Uh, you want to eat right out of the bag? Mm. You yeah. want to? Yeah, yeah, why not? Or uh, put it in the plate. Oh, man. I just broke the spoon. Oh, did you? oh no. Wow. Army uh -huh. issue spoon. Oh. That's disgusting. Side of thing. That's okay. It doesn't taste too bad. You want to go run up and uh, get a couple of Sunday spoons? Yep. Now let's have a little taste of the uh, fruit drink. Gotta be even, Steven. Thank me later. All right. Nope. So we got some Sunday spoons happening here. All right. Let's see here. Ooh, look at that! Right. I don't have to tell you what uh, chili does when you eat chili. Yeah. Let's get a little video of that happening. Okay. You be here. Uh, yeah, just off to the side there. Okay, might as well do a little quick video. Okay, got it. So you guys have had these spoons for quite some time, eh? Oh, yeah. So something you guys might not know is that uh, my uncle's father was one of three brothers. And uh, he owned a restaurant when he first came here. It's called Cosmos, and this is where the spoons come from. Yes. Uh, his brother, which is his uncle again, who's who's passed on, used to own Coco's, and that's that was in Toronto as well. And the third brother, who's still alive, owns Sassafras, which is a pretty popular um, restaurant during a film festival, and that's down in Yorkville. Uh, so restaurants and businesses of that type. Runs in the family. Yeah, for sure. You ready to dive in? <laughs> yeah. You want to go first or you want me to go first? I don't know. Um, it kind of looks like canned chili. It doesn't look too bad. looks like chili to me. All right. You want to do it? Three, two, one. All go. right. That's not bad. That's good, huh? You think? Ooh. I'm making a mess. I gotta be right back. I gotta grab a paper towel. Alrighty. Good to get another drink. You'll thank me later. Yeah, and he's gonna be trying uh, the thing again. I'm gonna put a little 
Tabasco sauce. <laughs> Yeah. Oops. There we go. This guy's taking forever with the paper towels. Hey, you got it? Yeah. Marvelous. Got a whole roll. All right. All right. Thank you. No problem. You want to try it? You want to like eat all of it or you want to eat some of it? I'll eat all of it. I'm pass that. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna squeeze it out. Sure. Ew. Ew. Looks like poop. <laughs> Alright. You want the rest? No. How's your chili taste like? You put Tabasco sauce, didn't you? <laughs> and you've been messing with my drink as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I couldn't help myself. Oops. Made a little mess there. Uh, thank you very much. Yeah. That's okay. Tabasco's not too bad. Mm -hmm. Gives us some spice. Okay. I'm kind of done with that. Yeah. Uh, add me another big pile there. Thank you very much. Yeah. Go big or go home. Kind of our home though. Already. I better drink some before you drink any more. Mm -hmm. I have good. to say it's really good. Yeah. Okay. So let's dive into that hamburger bun over there. Okay. Why they gave us a hamburger bun? I'm guessing for the chili, but... Same kind of philosophy, we crack it open. Oh, wow. It looks the same. That looks disgusting, actually. I'm still game. Yeah? Okay, let's see what this is all about. So this is the bun, the disgusting bun. Identical to the bread that we had on the first video. The size of that hand is like Godzilla hand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. All right, so you wanna try some of this with the chili? Mm, no, the peanut butter. Yeah, okay. Where'd the knife go? The overly sized knife. So we'll do some choppy choppy. Alright, so that'll be your half. I'll take this half. And. Can I trouble you with another? Yeah. There you go. Thank you very much. No problem. Always chopping with a big knife. You. The cat's here. Yep. Our cat's, uh, his name is Oscar. And he gets mischief here and there. That piece there. All right, thank you very much. No problem. We're gonna sandwich it. The bun seems kind of sweet, eh? Is it? No. There's a sweetness to it. Yeah. It's very dense. It's very dry. Mm -hmm. Exactly like the first one. Yeah. I'm guessing it's supposed to go with the chili, but we'll see. Nope. Mm. All right. 
add to the refuse pile. Okay, done with that. Let's talk about dessert, because dessert is always number one in our All list. Right. Again, we've got a lovely tactical green bag with the Canadian leaf on it. With the flag. With the flag. Cooking instructions. Uh, place the unopened pouch in a pot of boiling water. We're we gonna boil it. No. 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 Uh, we're gonna skip that. Return water to boil and heat for five minutes. Nope. Remove pouch, open at notches, and serve. Let us serve. All right. So we squeeze everything down. Same problem. There we go. Wow. Here, I'll give you that. I'm going to grab my camera. This is a very messy one, eh? Yeah. They look like slices. Yeah, they are in fact slices. So I think what we'll do is we'll clean off our uh, Sunday spoons and go at it one apiece. You get a. Thank you. Yeah. I better drink this before he takes any more. <laughs> I couldn't resist. Alrighty. You do that as first? No, go for it. I don't know what it is. It's a cocktail. It's a fruit cocktail. That's exactly what it is. It's exactly those things that you buy from, from the store. You get like a jar of uh, sliced peaches or cherries. Del or Monte. Del Monte. That's I not bad. It's not right. I wouldn't call it a dessert though. No. I've seen better dessert in my time. Apple? Yeah. Surprising. We can tell what it is without even looking at the label. Mm -hmm. All right. So, apple's done. Let's see that coffee over there. What are you supposed We're to do with coffee? Uh, so, pour, add hot water, and stir and enjoy. That's interesting because it's like upside down with the instructions. That's okay. Uh, we got cold water. You want cold water with coffee? Well, why not? Ice cap. I've had that, you know, I like ice cap. Wow. It smells like coffee. All right, let's see here. What is this called? Sweet and Creamy Original Instant Coffee Mix. The shape. Yeah, so we get this guy in here. I'm gonna shake a room. Should be. Looks like copy. Yeah. Got the copy color to it. I'm gonna ask you to toss a little bit in here. Just a bit. That's good. Want a little more? No. Uh, okay, maybe a little more. I, I don't drink coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers to everybody. Cheers. You know, it's like regular, you know, Cool down coffee. Yeah. Not bad. It's got a lovely bouquet. A bouquet and a lovely aroma. aroma. Mother, it's a, I'd have to say two thumbs up and you know, you know why. It's a coffee lover. Uh, the next piece, coffee crisp. Oh my. 
I think we know how this one's going to turn out. Let's see if we can find an expiration date. Is there... How old is it? Uh, I kid you not when I tell you that. I was uh -oh. in the military. <laughs> we were on Field X. And we had Ritz crackers that were expired. And so is this. Oh no, expired. Yes, indeed. It says September 5th of 2019. We are currently at what? The 20... 20, 24th or 25th, 2020. Yeah, this is January yeah, 25th. 25th. So it is a few months past date. Is that going to stop us? <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think so. And you know this month's flying, eh? It's almost the end of the month. Alright, you know what? We should check the date on this too. Oh, what's this? This one is rated 2020. Wow. So you. we won't get, like, uh, the gurgles. Nope. Are you curious for this? That's good. Mm hmm we got to get our candle happening. Mm-hmm. Look at this mess. Pigs. I wonder what happened to the Tabasco sauce. <laughs> I wonder what happened to my water. Mm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So these matches look a little smaller than the other ones. So we will... Oh. First time I did this, in one shot. Those were with the 10 year old matches, so we were kind of skeptical. Where is it? Oh! oh. No, my dad, no, I it. You got played. Played. Oh, wait a second. There you go. What I did was I picked it up and it just blew off, but that's okay. Tic Tacs, fresh mint, and guess what? What? These are officially expired as well. <laughs> expired. Uh, uh oh. Oh, there's four Tic Tacs. You're lucky. I was gonna try and steal one. Help if we can open this. Here, scissors. Ew, it touched my hand. Yeah, no, it's Ew. Okay. Two? Yeah. All right. Not bad. Don't taste expired. Nope. Minty. Minty. How do you like my breath? Woo! <laughs> Mint. <laughs> You have marvelous breath. <laughs> Wait. Can you smell me getting off the elevator? <laughs> you smell like a deli. What do you think about the Tic Tacs? Minty. Can you smell my breath? <laughs> Minty flavor. Yummy. <sighs> you have marvelous breath. <laughs> okay, so uh, thoughts on this one? My thoughts. Oh, we didn't try the beef jerky. Yeah, how can we forget oh. the man? Beef jerky. Do the honors. Right, thank you. So it has its lovely tactical green packaging as usual. Mm. Very impressive stuff. Uh, its ingredients include beef, I would hope so. <laughs> Water, salt, sugar, spice, soy sauce. Uh, refiners, molasses, sodium, can't Molasses. Say oh, sodium yeah. nitrate and smoke. So we tear this here. Before we do, you want to do a salute to Yarny? 
Ready to roll? Let's go. Okay. Let's do now, it. This is made by the Greek Canadian Meat Company. Uh, 1390 Hopkins Street in Whitby. All right, Canadian Ontario. stuff. Ontario. That deserves to be in the packet. However, we cannot open it. Yeah. So we use there. our oversized knife. Wow, man. That's plastic. It looks like little <laughs> pieces. Wait. Yes, it is. Yeah, see? It's chunkified! <laughs> Ready? Oh yeah, look at that, man. It's like little tiny pieces. Not bad. That's pretty handy. That is pretty handy. Wow. I think it's good. I'm working over here. I'm good. All right. You want to give them thoughts? Because I'm going to be here a while. I say second round, all was good. The beef jerky is good. Mm -hmm. Peanut butter was good. And especially the uh, fruit punch, it was good. So I give it a two thumbs up for and the Tic Tacs and the matches. Two thumbs up. Okay. What about the uh, apple slices? The apple slices, to me, taste like the Monte. Exactly like the store. Smell and taste like apple uh, slices, which yep. is pretty impressive. Yep. I think it's well. Sliced apples. Okay, cool. So what's your thoughts? I liked the chili was good. Chili, yes, that uh, was a good chili. The bread was sketchy. Mm -hmm. The apple slices were good. The Tabasco sauce, which I didn't put on my food, but somebody put on my <laughs> food, was good. And the fruit punch, which someone took, uh -oh. was good. Um, coffee, I'm not a coffee guy, but same, it seemed like it was okay. Coffee, Love crispy, coffee. past dates, date. That's okay. We still ate it. I had a good yeah. time with that. Beef jerky. I enjoyed that. It was good. Yeah, overall, everything, all the items were good, and uh, we survived this round. If you are interested in all this stuff that we did, the uh, army ration food, if you're in the area, you can go to our buddy. Where is he located at? He's located at One Stav Bank Road. Uh, North Porth Credit in Mississauga. His store is called Army Issue. Go to armyissue.com. And his name is Jeroon. Hope you all enjoyed the video. And if we get uh, more great feedback like the others, we'll do another one. And for myself, Alan, and Christopher, see you later. And I'll send you another video as soon as I can. Bye for now. Bye bye.